Hi everybody, this is Monica Lapore. Most people use my nickname, Doc. It's great to see you. I'm really glad to be able to bring this exercise video to you for Camp Abilities. I want you to know that we wish that we were with you in the pool doing all kinds of fun swimming. But since we can't do that right now, we are gonna do some exercises that will help you to get ready for swimming. And a couple of things that you should know before you get started. First, if you have hair that's longer than your ears, like down to here, put it back in like a ponytail or put some kind of hat or something on to get your hair away from your face so it doesn't get kind of bollocked up in your arm motions. Um, secondly, you should have on some workout clothes. So I have this great uh, old Camp Abilities Tucson shirt on and I have a pair of sweatpants on. Next, you're gonna make sure that you have sneakers on that are tied. Let's see, mine, yep, all good. My sneakers are ready for action. The last thing before we begin is you need to find a chair that doesn't have any armrests. It doesn't have to have a back either, but I didn't have one of those. So I have a chair that's nice and stable. It's not a rocking chair, so that when I sit down in it, it's not gonna fall over or anything. So as soon as you got those things ready, we are ready to do our swimming exercises without a pool. You ready? Here we go. All right, I got my chair here. I'm gonna sit in my chair. That's our first thing we're gonna do. So I'll wait to make sure everybody's got their chair and they're sitting nicely in the chair with their workout clothes on and we are gonna start our warm up. All right, we're going to be doing four warm-up exercises. Then we're gonna do some freestyle arms, backstroke arms, and then we're gonna do some streamline arms and streamline arms and legs. About six minutes together. So our first um, exercise is I don't know. So to do I don't know exercise, you're just gonna lift your shoulders up towards your ears and then put them down again. A lot of people, if I ask them, what do you think is next? They'll say, I don't know. So can you do that five times with me? What's next? I don't know. What are we gonna do after? I don't know. What's the best thing of the day? I don't know. When are we gonna go in the pool? I don't know. Great, you did five I don't know exercises, fabulous. The next one we're gonna do is one where it's kind of funny called the ain't got no money. So we're gonna make believe that somebody said, do you have any money? And you reached in your pockets and you went like this and put your palms up. I ain't got no money. Can you do that? Put your hands on your waist. You have any money? I don't have any money. Try it again, hands on your waist. Do you have any money? I don't have any money. Put your hands at your waist. Do you have any cookies? I don't have any cookies. Do you have any money? No, I ain't got no money. Let's do one more. Hands at your waist and bring your palms up and out to the side. And now we have successfully started to warm up our rotator cuff area, the area that helps us rotate our shoulder, the shoulder's really important in swimming, so we're gonna be doing a lot to make sure it's nice and warmed up. The next one we're gonna do warms up your shoulder area and your upper back and a little bit of your arms. And we are gonna be doing a slap, clap. So put your hands down at your side so that you're going to slap the side of the chair gently or I usually do instead, I slap the side of my leg. Slap, and then arms come, very arms are straight out, like a written letter T, goes all the way to the top, and clap. And slap our thighs, and clap our hands, and slap our outside of our thighs. Big motion, clap your hands, clap and slap. So right to the outside of your thighs for the slap and big arm movement to clap. 
Let's do five. Clap, slap, clap, and slap. You can do it. Clap and slap. Two more. Clap and slap. One more. Clap and slap. That's going to be a really great warm-up exercise for when we do our streamline exercise later. So I could see you really getting warmed up already. Great job. Keep up the good work. So we're staying in a seated position, and what we're going to be doing is half helicopters. So as you know, a helicopter has blades that stick out from in front from the um, top of the um, helicopter part. I don't know what it's called, cabin. So we're going to make believe we're two of those blades, and we are going to just rotate our body a little. Don't bang your arms on the wall behind you. Don't bang your arms on the back of the chair. We're just going kind of to the front and the side. Let's do five full helicopters. One helicopter, two helicopter, three helicopter, four helicopters, five helicopters. Excellent, we did five, great job. Good work, good work. All right, what's next? I gotta, I'm looking at my book over here. So, this is a good one. It's called running arms. So, running arms. Here we go. And start moving your arms like as if you're running. Our arms are bent a little bit. Our thumbs are up. Good job. And we're just pushing our arms forward. And we are gonna do 20 of these. And one, two, three, four, five, keep going, you got it. Seven, eight, get your body warmed up. 10, 11, 12, eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great, we are now warmed up. We are ready to do some more exercises for swimming, okay? Super. The first one is probably everyone's favorite, and that's the freestyle. So what are we gonna, how are we gonna do the freestyle sitting in a chair? Can you first watch me, okay? So here I go, I'm bending over so that my torso, my chest, is on my thighs. And then I'm gonna put one arm in front of me so my ear is right next to my bicep. This arm is gonna be back here. And we are going to make believe we're swimming the freestyle. All right, are you ready? You ready? Okay, go. Put your chest down on your thighs. One arm in front and swim 20 of these. One, two, three, four, five, reach out, six, great, keep your chest down, eight, nine, ten, keep going, you're almost there, thirteen, fourteen, make sure that your ear goes near your, your bicep, fifteen, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20, 20. Woo, that's getting me nice and warm. I bet we better take a little rest. Shake out those arms. If we did 20 of those, that means we probably got all the way down to the end of the pool and back. It takes me about 21 strokes to get down and back, get down and back. So we might have done 50 yards. That would be great. All right, let's do a backstroke one like that and then we'll repeat the freestyle. So watch me first, okay? So I gotta go to the, a little bit to the beginning of my chair. So I'm not all the way back. I pushed myself forward in the chair. My feet on the floor. And I'm going to make sure my thumb comes up first. And then when I turn it, my pinky is going to go backwards. Thumb up, turn, pinky back. 
thumb up, turn, pinky back. Thumb up, turn, pinky back, okay? So your thumb goes up and then you turn so your pinky is up to go backwards. Thumb comes up and then turn so your pinky goes back first. So we're gonna do 20 of those, all right? So 20, ready? Okay. One, two, thumb up, pinky back, thumb up, pinky back, thumb up, pinky back. Four, thumb up, pinky back, thumb up, pinky back. Six, seven. Do you see how my body is rotating as I'm doing it? My body rotates a little bit. 12, 13, come on, we just have seven more. 14, thumb up, pinky back, pinky back. 17, 18, rotate, 19, and 20. Whew. That was a good one, backstroke. One arm at a time, alternating. So I'm gonna go down a little bit so you can see what the top of my hand looked like. So you did thumb up and then you turned and you put your pinky back and you rotated, didn't you? Yeah, thumb up, pinky back and rotate. We're gonna do that one more time, but first we are going to do our freestyle again. Let's do it. Back in the chair for me. All right, I'm sitting nice in the chair. My feet are on the ground. I bend over, come on and do it with me. Bend over so my chest is on my thighs. This time I'm not gonna look at you because in this stroke, your head should be down like this. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm not gonna look at you, okay? But we're gonna do 20 for each arm. You ready? Bend over. One arm out, one arm behind. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You could do it. Nine, ten. Halfway there. Just do ten more. We'll go backwards, nine, eight, seven, reach out, six, five, four, keep swimming, three, two, one, woo, wow, we did another 50 yards. We're doing good, we are doing great. You might need to take a rest here. If you're starting to sweat, more power to you. If your arms are getting a little bit tired, you're doing great. We only have one more of those, uh, the backstroke to do. Take a rest, and then we'll be doing some streamline, and then we're done with these exercises for now. It'll make you a much stronger swimmer. And guess what? You don't have to just do them today. You can do them three times a week until your pool opens again. It really will make you so much more stronger for the swim. Well, I've talked enough and we rested enough. We have 20 backstrokes to do. We're gonna do 20 backstrokes. Let me remind you, we're going thumb up and then we go pinky back as we rotate. Thumb up, pinky back. You ready? Okay, go. One, two, three, rotate, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10 more, 11, 
12, 13, 14, 15, five more. Thumb up, pinky back, rotate, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Woo! Fabulous. Take a little bit of a rest, a little rest here, okay? So we have two more exercises. We're gonna have the sitting streamline and then the standing streamline. And then you can go get some water and sit down and get cooled off for a while before your next activity. In this activity, we are gonna be starting with our palms up, our hands down to the side, and we are gonna push our arms to the top so that our hands clap, and then we're gonna hold them here, okay? But you know what? I'm gonna get down like this because instead of the clap, let's do something different. Let's be, instead of doing it this way, because we did something like that already, let's do it this way. One hand on top of the other. Show me the, your face of your hands, right? One hand on top of the other. Show me the face of your hand. Push it up and squeeze your ears together and hold for 20 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Squeeze it, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, relax. I was gonna have us do it this way, but we did something like that already. While you're relaxing, think about it again. We're gonna have one hand on top of the other. Show me your palm of your hand. All right, let's do that again. Ready, set, go. Squeeze it up, squeeze your ears, squeeze your ears. This is what it looks like from the side. Squeeze it. You're doing 20 seconds, that's eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Wow, that is so good. So while you're resting, let's remember when we use that. We're swimming. We're ready to start a race or maybe start a lap. And we're in the pool and we hold on to the side and we put our arm out. And what do we usually do? We look this way, we go like this and we push off the wall. Shoo! So if I was holding the wall and I went this way, I would go away from you. Or I would go towards you. Streamline position, yeah. So we did two nice 20 second streamlines. Now you have two more to do, but this time I want you to do it from a sitting position and we're gonna make believe we pushed off the wall. Watch me, watch me. Sitting, my feet are on the floor and I have to push my bottom to the edge of the chair. Okay, I'm at the edge of the chair. So not all the way back, push it to the edge of the chair. Great. One hand on top of the other. Show me this. And once we get our hands up there, we're gonna push off the wall into a big streamline. So your hands will stay up here and you'll push off the wall, make believe. We have five of those to do. Ready for this? Yes, you are. Here, here. Push it up and stand up. And sit back down again. Woo! That was one. We're gonna try to do five. No, we're not gonna try. We're gonna do five. Here we go. Hand, top of the other one. Squeeze and push. Great. That's two. 
You ready for three? Okay. Push. Great, we did three streamlines. Think about when you get in the pool next, you're gonna make believe you're doing that off the wall. You won't go straight up to the sky. You'll go straight toward the other end of the pool. Yeah. All right, here we go. Squeeze it up and lift off. Great. Show me one more great one. Here, here, push it up, push off, streamline. Great. So we did a lot of great exercises to get you ready for the, when the pool is opened. Since we don't have the pool and not at camp right now, all of those exercises will help you to become a better swimmer. So don't just do it today. See if you could do it several times a week. And, there, and the next thing you know, you'll be ready to get swimming with your wonderful swim strokes and your streamlines. Have a great day. Thanks for listening.